Wait, can I move independently now? Yep. Here we go. Okay. I'm going to use lay on hands on him. Yeah, we're out of initiative, so you guys can do whatever. Say, if we uh, take a small rest, I can use Bardic Inspiration, and that should heal me up the rest of the way. Then I'll give you... I don't think you can heal with Bardic Inspiration, but... It adds... I think it adds heals to whatever you get for the rest. Oh, yeah, that's okay. right! You do have that. I forgot about that. Can I go ahead I and give him... I don't exactly how many, but I think it's like one or two. Can I give him with all five points? You'd you want... I don't know, can you? Or if we, have... if, if we take the hour, though, uh, you won't have to burn your heal, though. Because you only get that once every long rest, your five points. Oh, I don't think we can. Wait, we wait okay, so if we rest, do I get heal? No, no, you don't have Song of Rest yet. That doesn't happen until uh, second level. Guys, so... I don't think we should linger here. Yeah. One got yeah. away, there, there could be more. Yeah. Lingering is the best idea. Agree. Uh, Carry him into the cart. Let's get going. Agreed. That's actually a good idea. I do Are you guys going to follow the goblin or no? I do uh, roll a survival again, Flynn. That's you, Tyler. Yeah, I got it. Oh. I was looking for the button. I'm doing real bad on that roll, though. We could send the uh, hawk All ahead. Right. So, That's true. Uh, I'm just going to give this one to you. So, um, on closer inspection, uh, you see that, uh, that where the goblin ran, it's a... Uh, uh, like there's there's a there's a fairly well traveled trail, and it looks like um, two human sized bodies have been recently drug up that trail. I thought he was a dwarf. Medium sized. Human sized. Yeah. Human sized. So that means that uh, they killed the people who hired us, and then drug their bodies away. Do, you, do we want like to that. recover them or just go on, carry on to town? He didn't have very much money. Uh, but he can't pay us now either. Yeah, he didn't exactly. have very much money on him. Like I do need some money, so I would say like look for him maybe. But if we abandon the goods, we can't even sell them if we take them into town. Like, did you check just his purse, or the, how about the other guy that was with him? Did you check his uh, purse too? No, just one. Here's the thing: if we abandon these goods, we have a chance to lose them unless we hide the cart. Oh, yeah, we don't want to leave the cart in the middle of the... Or we can split up. Never split No, no. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> no, me and Ashik, we got this. Let's go. <laughs> Who has stealth? Whoever has stealth. Right, goes so you guys going to hide the cart? Yeah. All right, you guys hide the cart. You bury it. Like, uh, You find some thick bushes and stack stuff up on it. It's Before we go any well further... Hidden. Yeah, we're yeah, gonna the horse have to horse and the nose and just go. We're actually going to have to yeah. have the five hit points or whatever. Yeah. Oh, uh, he should be. If he adds them to his, I gotta add them to myself. Uh, if you put them back in your character sheet, then they'll go up. Otherwise, I can grab them. Yeah. Uh, but uh, so who among us has is good at sneaking? I know well, I am. I have Hobbit stealth and medium armor, so I am. I am bad at sneaking. Well, All right. I'm a well, in your, uh, that speaks for itself. Set you guys. Is, Set yourselves up on this trail the way you guys are going to head down, because we're going to be moving a map here in a bit, but... Okay, I'm going to be... Well, you have a, a chain shirt, right? Or is it uh, scale mail? Scale mail. Oh, yeah, you have disadvantage on stealth. And I guess I could, like, sneak ahead. And I'll take out. point. Well, I'll I'm... take point of the group, at least. Okay. I could, like, try to sneak ahead and try to do... Uh, and the hawk could also help. The hawk has really good perception. I'm going to stick near to Ashik. Yeah, he's got advantage on perception. Yeah. All right. Okay. So you guys head down the trail. Um, is anybody... All right. Um... I want to uh, sneak ahead. Okay. Like off the um, trail. For the stealth? All right. Come on. Let me make sure I have normal on. Make sure we wait for the stealth roll. Let's Nine. Wait. <laughs> Okay. Um, just cannot roll. Yeah, no, just leave it like, yeah, so we're, we're off this battle map now. Just leave you guys in the same order that you're in. And we'll... <laughs> so, I can, so I can see what's going do on. You wanna, do you want to pull it back a little bit then? Are we good? All right. All right. So you guys are good. Um, 
Okay. So you're you're sneaking down the trail. Uh, what's your passive perception? Twelve. Twelve. Okay. Um, and are you actively looking? Yeah. Okay. Roll a perception check. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Wow. After about uh, three or about ten minutes down the trail, um, you you trip a trigger of a snare. Uh, give me a deck save uh, with disadvantage because oh. you rolled a one. I just cannot roll today. Fourteen. All right. Uh, you are suspended above the ground. About ten feet above the ground, upside down by your ankle. That's great. <laughs> Tyler, shoot him down with disdain. <laughs> <laughs> I shoot an arrow with one eye closed. I'm gonna roll disadvantage. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and you still had a good roll. And you still got it. That's All right. Uh, so you you uh, <laughs> you shoot the rope. And as you hit the ground, can I try to land dexterously with like acrobatics <laughs> on your head? Uh, <laughs> so I don't land on my head. Do you really want to roll again? <laughs> this is end up poorly. Oh, so I don't take damage. I mean, we're already... okay. You can you can roll to take half damage. A crit failure. Twenty one. All right, you take one point of damage. All right, I recovered as that air. Right. I changed my mind. <laughs> we let the dwarf die. <laughs> We're already on this path. Let's see it through. All right. I recovered the right. arrow because I made that, and I love it. This one's for you. That one had Carlos's name on it. If he didn't die, then... All right. So are you still uh, leading the way down the trail, Simon? <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, give me another uh, perception check. Do you want me to roll stealth too, or just perception? Uh, just perception. I'll I'll let your stealth carry through. I'm assuming you're 18. moving. All right. You and only you spot a pit uh, in the middle of the trail. It's a, it's six feet wide, uh, and it's covered. It's still covered. I I go back and let them know. Okay, so you do let everybody yeah. know about the pit. I wasn't sure. I mean, they did shoot an arrow and knock you out of a tree. <laughs> we saved him. Yeah. All right. Great. Uh, Oh yeah. Yeah, I I guess I sneak back to scouting. Okay, so you you let everybody know about the yeah about the pit, and you guys all continue on your way. And now I gotta do this one, right? Yeah. I want to climb up into a tree. I have to take a leak. (laughs) Okay. No, I'm just kidding. Oh. Okay, bio break in 13 minutes. In, in 13, 13 minutes? minutes? Yeah. yeah. That's a really weird time, but okay. <laughs> How three it's, 47. it's 3 o'clock. Does the hawk oh, okay. see everything? Does the hawk see all? Is Mike using the hawk to spy on Cliff as he goes? He would be. Halfling's fitting. <laughs> I'm not a halfling. <laughs> Tyler's the halfling, right? Yeah. 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 Oh, I thought Tyler went up to take a leap. No, <laughs> no, it was Cliff. Oh. Cliff's got a little halfling in him too. <laughs> All right. Well, tonight, I do have an insatiable desire for carnal pleasures. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? All right. So after you guys follow the trail, you eventually. Uh, following the goblin's trail, you come across a large cave in a hillside, five miles from the scene of the ambush. A shallow stream flows out of the cave mouth, which is screened by dense briar thickets. A narrow dry path leads into the cave on the right-hand side of the stream. I vaguely remember this part from before. (laughs) Uh, Uh, Let's check for traps here. Can can I walk across the stream, or is it too deep and fast? 
you can walk across the stream. Well, we, it's not even as that athlete. deep of a stream. We, like, uh, uh, but it, I mean, you can't <laughs> like you can't really quietly splash across the stream. I, I turn to uh, Siladin and ask him if uh, he'll have. Well, can you uh, like have your like take control of your like bird's senses and like fly into the cave like twenty feet and then fly back out just to. Does the bird have dark vision? Well, the like bird. it. It's a oh, hawk. Can we tie a torch to him? It, it doesn't have to go very far, just 20 feet in. I'm not asking. I... Uh, cast light on it. <laughs> hey, uh, can Uthrin set, set, throw me across the stream so I can land quietly? Ooh, yes. Do yes. It. Athletics. Okay, here we go. All right, I'm going to need an athletics check from uh, Uthrin, oh. and then I'm going to need a dexterity check, uh, probably an acrobatics check to land quietly. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> you get thrown across the stream successfully. <laughs> <laughs> so awesome! Yeah, this is <laughs> so awesome. Uh, but you make a little bit of a racket when you th go slamming into a bush. Oh no! Okay, I'd like to. Uh... Damn it! I don't want to do anything. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'd like to look around and see if I see anything in this patch of woods. Um, all right. So. Hang Can on, I walk? Wait. Can I move my character around? Yeah, there? yeah. Go ahead and move it around. Can they see what I see? Um, yes. Because I see what I see. Yeah, well, so what you see is you see two goblins readying, readying bows through the thicket that are going to shoot at your friends. And the, we need initiative rolls. But on which side? On Thanks the, for the warning. Or on they're, the outside. Outside. they're on my side. Uh, we From can't the see that. Yeah, I don't black. see it, so. Oh, 16. Do you guys not see what I see over here? No, oh, no. wait. No. Uh, yeah, black. no, I don't think. Yeah, they don't. Oh, they don't see what you see. That's interesting. Oh, yeah, we don't see it. Can I, leap, can I leap across the stream after him? Or is it too late now? You can well, so he can he can warn so they don't get the the bonus round. But wait, so they can see us, but we can't get any perceptions. I make them? a motion to everyone to get down when I see them pointing arrows. Yeah, because they they have hidden like arrow slots built into the thicket. Oh, all right. My cast fire on the thicket. <laughs> <laughs> I rolled an intelligence check to understand what you were saying. Okay. I have 18, though, so we're good. Oops. All right. Uh, make sure your uh, turn order is updated in there. Hey, I so You only have, like, four people there. I'm not in there. Do we need initiative again? Yeah, your initiative. Everybody's in there. Oh, I, I, only, I, don't see see the, I only see two goblins, Syllabit, and Flynn. Yeah, me too. Seven. Okay. Well, let me clear everybody out, then. And let's re-add. Because I rolled a 21 after you said initiative the first Damn. time, and I want to keep that. Yeah, okay, so yeah, no, that's fine. You can just manually update it. I also I got, got 21. <clears throat> they still don't see them, huh? Nope. Hmm. That's pretty cool, though. That's a neat... Stop! I only see, like, the corner of the icon, but it looks the same as the other one, so I got it. This is not going very well for us so far. That's why well, I laughed for me. so hard, because when I moved my player icon across the stream, they immediately revealed themselves. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> nice. All right, uh, Flynn, I need your initiative. Oh, six. Oh, jeez. <laughs> That's not good. <laughs> Everyone There's on this side rolled decently. Yeah. I, I, I tumbled. These, this map looks more like it's 10 to 20 feet per block, but... Uh, no, it's, I believe it's still 10. It's 5. Or 5, block, sorry. Um, but let me just see if there's a thing on here. No. It says 5. It's yeah, 5. 1 square is equal 5. I mean, it makes it easy for you guys. You can run all the way across the stream real quick. Oh, I have between me and, and goblins, I have Skald and the Dwarf. I think Skull might take another arrow. Oh, In the knee. In the All right. <laughs> uh, no more healing. No, right, no more healing. 
I have healing, but that won't do me any good. So you know that they're around there, and you can see that there's an opening um, up north. Run up and put your face in the hole. Block the hole. But it doesn't look like you're going to be able to shoot anything through the thicket. How are you making the, the little, uh, like... Uh, clicking and holding. The bloop. Is it click and hold? Oh, yeah. Look at that. Yeah, so you can see up here. Okay. Is this the entrance to the cave right here? Yes. Yeah. Okay. How steady is the stream? Uh, it's a pretty steady, like... It's not super... Like, it's not, uh... What's the word I'm looking? It's not rushing, but it's steady. Oh, so we can, but we can walk through it without a problem. Yeah. All right. All right. Well, I used my 25 feet. I can't quite get to them. Also, I'll use a bonus action to just move down here. No, okay. your, your actual action to do that. Okay, yeah. my actual action, whatever. And then I'll attack with my off. You can't attack anymore. You've used. Oh yeah, you're off. I've got an off hand. Okay. Uh, yeah, on that top one. Yep. Too bad you don't have your fighter proficiency yet. 14. All right. 14 is a... Oh, I've closed the goblins. Hang on. Goblin. <coughs> it's a goblin. Should pop you this have out. Light? You can only uh, that is a uh, miss. No. Oh. No. All right. If I die, I blame you, Matt. Simon. Okay. Oh. All right. 14 is a miss. So... Could I like move through the like get through the like directly through the brush uh, bushes? No, they are impenetrable. All right. Unless you throw a halfling through them. Well, the halfling got thrown into them, all right, which caused all the racket. Well, I can't see anything, so I rush over here. Okay. With my move. Oh, all right. Uh, well, I don't like rushing right there anymore. I'm just gonna... <laughs> I I'm still in disbelief that I told everyone to get down and what you guys do is run out. <laughs> <That's over. laughs> we're not very smart. Uh, I'm gonna use my uh, crossbow at the one that's right by uh, the dwarf. Okay. Uh, Twenty. All right, that is a hit. All right, so that's gonna be. Oh, I should mark these. Plus, Red. I have seven damage total. Okay, that one is dead. Nice, crow. Nice. Or no, you said the one near the dwarf. Yeah. The dwarf, sorry. Yep, that one. This one is... Alright. And yep, then with my uh, bonus action, I'm going to dash behind the dwarf and the goblin. So there? Yeah. Okay. It's the moose dash. Alright. Yeah. So now this goblin is stuck <laughs> not in a great spot he's going to move he's going well now actually he had an arrow ready so he's going to continue with his arrow and uh oh, let let stalled. loose at um Cilladan. oh no because he was he was already pointed that way and he had it drawn um all right uh and that is a miss yes unless nice. your ac is eight which I don't think it is. So, no. all right, yeah. So an arrow goes flying by your head, Siladan, uh, and then it is that goblin's dead. So let's just remove him from the order. No. Then it is Ulthrin's turn. No, Flynn, you wanted a pet, right? We could have a goblin pet. Take it in alive. No. No. I am also going to cross the river. And. Can you reach it? His ace, my AC is 13, uh, so you know. I can't hit him from here. Do you have a throwing weapon? No. But I'm going to... I'm just going to use my second action to... I can give you some uh, darts after the, after the fight, so you have a throwing weapon. I'm just going to try to right. be here, so maybe he... I think paladins actually get javelins at the start. I didn't take them. Yeah, I didn't, yeah, I didn't. Why would you want to be good? <laughs> uh, well, we have you know a ranger, a wizard, and a bard. Yeah, but you never know when you need a 
Dude, uh, you saw range. my bagpipes. You know I'm not in this for the fighting. <laughs> You're not in it for the music either. No. <laughs> so what I'm just here to leech experience. <laughs> I'm here to hide behind the dwarf. All right, Skull, it's your turn. Uh, Wait, did we get see. experience for that last fight? Um, yeah, so you guys, uh, I was supposed to tell you that before this happened, but I got distracted. Okay. Uh, you guys get 75 experience up to this point. Where do we put the experience at? In your character sheet. Okay, there we go. I see. And what I is it, 100 see. experience for the first level? 300, I think. 300? Three, yeah. Okay. I think um, we start farming wolves and turtles. <laughs> Boars. And, and worms. Let's go to Goldshire, guys. I need to Gold get my, uh, next stop. I need to create my worms. My worm bead. Right, I'm going to use Vicious Mockery on... Wait, hold on. That's I guess, yeah, 60 feet. Okay, yeah, I'm going to use Vicious Mockery on the goblin. Okay, and that gives him a disadvantage, right? When he nope. attacks? He has to do a... Don't, you know, it's not an attack. Don't think so. It has to do a saving throw. Uh, what's the saving throw? Hold on. Uh, saving throw is... Wisdom. Alright, so... He did not make it. Um, Alright, so then the effects of that is he has... You don't add Christmas, just 1d4, I believe. Yeah, it's 1d4. What it... But you did okay, roll so a 4. My, minus... Yeah, I rolled a 4. I added charisma for some reason. Okay. It's so he, did, he takes 4 damage? Yep. Yeah, I don't... Oh, I see. I have the add ability mod thing in there. Okay, I'll turn that off. I won't do that again. Alright. Okay. So he is hit... Uh, and he has still a damage. damage. Okay, I'm gonna move up here. Poor little goblin, feet. he has nowhere to go. He can, he could have run for it. Where is he gonna run? Through the cave. Ah, uh, he would never make it. There is one, two, three, four, five attacks of well, opportunity against him. Well, now there were just two. Nice. <laughs> we could all miss. Does the hawk get an attack of opportunity? No, no, he can't attack. I'm gonna go ahead and do uh, the firebolt on the. Don't miss and hit me. <laughs> Don't burn the woods down. Yes. Don't roll a one, please. I'll try. Everybody dies because we're all in the underbrush. <laughs> we're trapped between the woods. That's the end of the party. <laughs> we're trapped between all the woods and the the wall behind us, and we're just burning to death. All right. Well, this is called um, a quick trip to Fandalore. He's still alive. Oh. <laughs> I threw a big <laughs> I threw a big lighter. <laughs> Flynn. <laughs> All right. You can move through squares with uh, other people in them if you want to get in melee. Oh, oh never mind. Is that a natural hit. twenty? Yeah. Oh yeah. man, yeah. Roll crit damage. Does it, I think does it automatically do it for you? Oops. Oh, it's like a, wait, yeah, it does. Yeah, you, you got it right. Up. You can no, click I... under it again. Yeah, you should still be able to so, click under it. It did some damage. No, it uh, added added the crit for you. Oh, it no, didn't. it didn't. It didn't. Oh, it didn't. Oh. No, it didn't. Can you hit roll damage for the one above? Oh no, you're right. It did. It was six plus one. The crit was only a one. So it's seven damage. Yeah. I fucked up. I clicked the bong blow twice well, again. It's definitely dead, though. I hope. Uh, yeah, it is dead. Yay. It could have been the the goblin boss. That was the goblin boss, guys. That was the hardest goblin you're going to fight today. So that, that's 300 experience, Guaranteed. right? <laughs> I thought it was 3,000 experience. You might be right, actually. All right. Yeah, we're level four all of a sudden. All right, so area two. So the east side of the stream, following, flowing, uh, flowing from the cave mouth, a small area in the briar thickets has been hollowed out to form a lookout post or blind. Wooden planks flatten out the briars to provide room for guards to lie hidden and watch the area, including the pair of goblins that you just murdered. 
You see, I always just figured it was. I think when we ran it before, I thought saw it as like a watchtower. Nope, it was uh, use, hidden in the brush. Can I use wisdom to look around and see if they had any kind of alert system set up? Um. Yeah. Go ahead and roll a perception check, and then Flynn, uh, roll a perception check to search the bodies. Wait, where's the perception roll at? There's persuasion. Oh, there it is. Oh. If any of us, I mean, I've got goblin, but if any of you guys have the goblin language too, see if you can find like maps or writings or orders. Or... I don't have the language, but I do have the spell comprehend languages. I've got goblin, so I can look too. All right. Um, Seth, you don't really see anything that would be an early warning system here. Um, and then you find each goblin is carrying a scimitar and a short bow. Loot. Are either of these short bows better than my short bow? Uh, no, it's the same as your short bow. Okay. Except, oh, I mean, shit. it looks a little shittier. I, I, I accidentally clicked that again. That sucks. that all right so what's the plan stan is there take any... that break is there any right oh, yeah. or map yeah look out take a break. Casey. all right take a break what we have a ways to go anyways <sighs> or we should just all slay a dragon that should give us like enough experience to level up a couple times there is a dragon. In the what cave? If... All right. There you go, I slayed a dragon. What if I slay the dragon in song? Do I get the experience still? What if I forge a document that says I slayed a dragon? Only, only if you can beat it in a dance competition. What if I use my disguise kit to disguise myself as a dragon and let Tyler shoot me? Do we <laughs> get the experience then? Oh, I thought you were going to... Uh... <laughs> Do like a, a baiting dance for the dragon. <laughs> that was a sneaky dragon, Casey. <laughs> it was really small and it grew really large. Well, I run away. There's other things that do that too. So if I just type whatever I want into the uh, into the asset search, it does a web search for me too, and I can just drag things from the web. It's great. Nice. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that is really cool. So we might. Can, put, so can we fight Matt Damon? Yes. <laughs> How about a Volvo? I think uh, we could defeat a Volvo. <laughs> a Volvo? Yeah. Well, this is it's the like exact a... kind of place we would find Matt Damon, though. We're near a source of fresh water. <laughs> <laughs> is is what's his name? Uh, Gundren actually Matt Damon? We have to save him. I'd rather have us fight Mark Wahlberg. Yeah, but then we have to dance. No, because I saw the movie Max Payne, and that was terrible. No, but we have to dance. He's, he's going to have you the funky bunch with him. <laughs> yeah. No. See, we <laughs> we know what his weak point is. All we have to do is make fun of him for being Marky Mark. And then we can summon Donnie. Yeah. And intimidate him. <laughs> Wait, are you intimidating Donnie or are you no, Mark, intimidating with Mark with Donnie? Mark with Donnie. I don't know if that would work. That, why not? You yeah, might. I mean, Mark is a much better actor. Donnie's done a I'd, few things. But he, but he's done a crap ton of producing and stuff like that, so they're probably equivalent in success. I don't know, Mark. What if you're looking at musically? Uh, New Kids on the Block is much better than Marky Mark. Transformers yeah. probably made him all the money. Yeah, but Donnie Wahlberg's got like, he's got. Um... <laughs> 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 oh, he's a large creature too. Awesome. Right. So... Of course, he's a large cre creature. <laughs> <laughs> you should find the puppet one. <laughs> or the one where he's dressed Mike's up as, back. uh, what's his name? Oh, is everybody back now? Uh, uh, not the fabulous guy. Yeah. Uh, 
I keep wanting to say Da Vinci. That's not his name. It's no. It's uh. And what? What are we talking about? Uh, the the super fabulous Liberace? guy that no, no Matt Damon. Liberace. Yeah, was it Liberace? Yeah. Oh. Hmm. I think it was. Or was it Liberace or was it his lover? I think it was his lover. Because I never saw that He's movie a bottom. and have no intention of ever seeing that movie. We all know Matt Damon's a bottom. Nicolas Cage. Nice. Oh, yes. <laughs> that to... is amazing. He's that like is a... awesome. He's like a level 20 like a dance mentor or something. <laughs> yeah. Like he can just do everything. Dude, Nicholas Cage should be the guy who gives us our next quest to go on a hunt for a document that was hidden by the founders of the country 300 years ago. Nice. That's yeah, good. exactly. You guys are actually working for the Freemasons now? Yes. It's gold and, coin is trying to tell me something. <laughs> guys, do you see how the coin is rotated this way just slightly? Quick, give me There's that bottle 13. of water. He says a magnifying glass. There's 13 ridges, 13 original colonies. See how there's a five on the coin? Do you know what else has five? A hand, fingers. Exactly. <laughs> the key mean? is in your hand. Better cut it out. And then kidnap the president. And then well, only for funsies. You're on the list now. Well, wait, and which then... way is downstream, Tyler? Do we know which way is down? The water it flows out, out of the cave. cave. Okay. Well, then how does that? How do we know the water flows out of the cave? Roll an intelligence check. What if we because cut I off told their you heads? The water flows out of the cave. What if we cut off their heads and just toss the heads into the cave? As they're a already they're, they're already flowing down river. They're gonna come out at a choke point. We can kill them one at a time. We exactly. should have the. We should put light on the hawk and let the hawk just walk in there slowly. No, let's just down. light the hawk on fire. Can familiars <laughs> die, or do they just get yeah. sent back to the... You, you, you would have to cast a spell all over again, and it costs components to do okay. that. Like, but they don't actually, gold. like, die, die. No, you can keep no. summoning them. Yeah. Okay. They're like yeah. fey spirits that take on animal forms. Okay. So okay. And you happen. can always make it disappear as a, an action, so... I say send it in. Find out what's going on. Yeah, use its perception. If it gets killed, like, well, oh, there's really laggy. It'll be a while before you can summon again. But yeah. all right, so I mean, what's what's your guys' plan? Attack the darkness, the hawk, yeah. Leroy Jenkins. See if you can see anything. Can you change right, your so familiar you, uh, to like a I, bat or something that runs out the a, cave, or is it already? I, I have a dark vision, so I could uh, sneak in. I guess that's been working so far really well, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, I haven't triggered any traps. Eat up your rolls, Casey, man. if he were to resummon it as a bat, would the bat have dark vision or sonar or anything like that? Uh, or it... I think so. I'll yeah. look it up. Yeah, look it up for me. But that would up. Uh, I'm just saying, like casting the spell actually does eat up uh, gold. Like uh, in, as far as resources. How much go. gold? No, the the bat doesn't have dark vision for whatever. Uh, reason. It's got echolocation and keen hearing. It's that... got blind sight though. Whatever that means. Might okay. be useful. Yeah. So, like, it can see in the dark, but it can't see in the dark, if that makes sense. It can tell it uses an alternative method. But not what they are. I got you. A rat probably... Well, oh, does a rat have dark vision? I'm going to move the entrance of the cave. I'm just thinking, because, like, it animals costs, like okay. that so you, shouldn't cause any kind move, of suspicion, right? You move inside and in, in, into the cave. Um, just inside the cave mouth, a few uneven stone steps lead up to a small dark chamber on the east side of the passage. Oh. On the east side or the west way. side? Because I see one on the west side. No, it's the east side. It's, that's the east side. That's how directions work. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh, the, ca the cave narrows to a steep fissure at oh. the far end uh, and is filled with the stench of animals. Savage snarls and the sounds of rattling chains greet your ears where three wolves are chained up just inside the opening. Each wolf's chain leads to an iron iron rod driven into the base of a stalagmite. So they can't, they, like, they're basically stuck where they are. Well, actually, they can probably, actually, no, yeah. Tyler, now the wolves are a... barking at the door. I have animal handling. Yes! Uh, you initiative. Your, uh... Wait, he has his pet. Yeah, okay. Tyler can get his pet now. Oh, crap. Wait, are we all rolling We're initiative? initiative. Oh. Yeah. I'm not in there. Anybody who's in here who wants to be in the fight needs to roll initiative. Eight. 
This is going well. Uh, I rolled a four, and I'm right up on their faces. Eight. So wait, is there like a, a door between us, or? Nope. No door. Hold door. Hold the door. Hold the door. Hold it. So actually sneaking would have worked really well, probably. There was Not by you. Probably smell you. And then we could have, like cast sleep on them, and they'd have all fallen asleep. Plus Mike, when he rolls a one. Oof. That is not good, Mr. Wolf. Stop it. Does he... Does he fall asleep on his own? Is he gonna no, be... he no. just goes at the end. No, he's the tame one. He's not nope. gonna fight. So that way, uh... Our halfling can uh, have a, a pet. Alright. Is everybody on the initiative order? Quickly. Uh... Yes. Looks like it. The order never makes sense to me, but he moves it later. Oh. Man, that's not great. Get him, Flynn. All right, Flynn. Do we get to know which one is the sixteen? Is the next in line or no? Oh, here, let me uh, add some stuff here. I have a question. Uh, uh-huh. Are they still chained up? Yes. So we don't actually have to go in there. He could just shoot them all. Except for... Um, um, I suppose. Unless they can somehow get out of their chains. Except for Sindar. He's like right there within their attack range. I can move through people. Because I'm a hobbit. I'm going to go up to where he is. On top of him. Okay. <laughs> and use animal handling to try to calm them down. Calm the bitches down. With some okay, down. go ahead and roll Slide animal down. handling. Uh, which, uh, you can, which, which one? Red, Damn green, it. or blue? Uh, that doesn't matter. Yeah. Well, right. fuck. They are still not happy to see you. You guys smell like food, not like goblins. Alright, and then... Should have covered ourselves here. in the blood of those goblins we killed. This wolf here is going to um, bite at Sindar. Uh, I don't think you can stay in his slot. Can you actually get between turns to be on it? There you go. Sorry. Yeah, you have to move out. Um, all right. So now we roll a bite versus a C. Uh, a 23 definitely hits. You take eight damage. Ouch. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, do you have any health left? Yeah, he's still got a few. Yeah, he's he's doing okay ish. Alright, um It's a big bite. It is oh. now uh Silidan's turn. I think we lost Mike. It has oh. a... Mike? Okay, yeah, I'm going to connected. Oh, you just have no. the symbol there. Here. You don't hear me? Yeah, yeah you, we're you're good. Here. You're good. Yeah, we're, you're good. I'm fire, firebolt the red one. Okay. Eight is a miss. <laughs> oh. Yeah. All right. And I'm going to uh, move Ashik. you in case he can do that. Yep, yep, you can move as well. <laughs> what are you going to do, Matt? Um, I need to... Okay. Well, I think you can move through people's squares if you want to tackle one of them out of the way. I know. I'll just move there. And then you could... On top of somebody? I probably... Yeah, I'm on top of the cliff. Yeah, because you can't stay there. Hmm. Does it draw t an attack of opportunity to move through him? I guess. Well, like I was going to say, like if he like uh, he uses if he uses action to like uh, knock him back with athletics, then he could like rush the green could, one. Yeah. Well, 
There's something behind. It. Yeah, all right. And I'll bull rush the red one. No, that would give uh, attack of opportunity. No. Because you would knock it back against the wall, and then you could like go right where it was. All right, I'm gonna do that. I don't remember what I have to roll for that. Athletics. Just athletics versus their athletics. All right, so you're you're bull rushing which one? Red. Red. Okay. Thirteen. All right, and versus his, it's versus AC, right, Carlos? Athletics versus. Oh, it's versus it, it athletics. Contest. And athletics is strength, yep. right? Uh, natural twenty. Damn. Wow. <laughs> so that's. I think you're going to get an attack of opportunity on you. How did a wolf beat? Uh, whatever. I guess you could like. You rolled a natural twenty. <sighs> I don't know what you want. <laughs> well, shouldn't I, he have had I a disadvantage because he was chained? Uh, he's not. Like he's chained uh, back here, so I mean he has a little bit of range yet to go. It's not forward. super restrictive. Yeah. Well, you, you better hope that you one shot him with your offhand attack, because otherwise he's going to get an attack of opportunity on you when you get away. Oh yeah. So. Ooh. I got a roll of twenty-three. For nine damage. Nine damage. Red. I don't think you get a. Nice. I don't. You can't add strength at level one. Uh, I can. I think so. No, uh, offhand is just weapon damage. Yeah. But I've got the two weapon fighting. It allows you to add your ability I'm modifier to the damage on your second attack. Oh, shit. Page 70. I, I, have the... oh, no, I, thought that I wonder if I have that on no. my rogue. I don't think I do. No, that's uh, a fighter thing. That you get. Yeah, you do get at level one. You lucky bastards. Yeah, yeah. You get everything at level one. All right. So you did nine damage to him. He is still up. He's not looking great. All right. Um, it is now uh, Blue Wolf's turn. Um, let's see. Blue Wolf is going to tug on his chain. Oh, uh, you can't. The dwarf can't stay there, though. Oh yeah, you have to move somewhere. You can't oh. occupy the same square as a uh, as okay. an ally. Uh, Sindar is just you can you can up. you can slide in and go next to the wolf. Where? Um, the bottom wolf. right there. Here. Bottom. Okay. You use attacking red wolf. Yeah. Out I'll do that. There. Okay. So blue wolf is going to tug on his chain and try to get off. He gets off of the chain. Uh oh. He's off um, the chain. He's gonna go up here and attack the dwarf. AC is 16. And here's where we all die. Um, and he crits. Oh, God. <laughs> Shit. For 12. Wow. I have one health left. <laughs> if he crits again, you might die. Nate, you're still up. All right. Uh, Scold. All right. So our spells haven't reset, right? Because we didn't rest. Yeah. Yep. Um, you still have your heal, though, don't you? Yeah, I have Cure Wounds, which I think takes up an action. Yeah. Uh, I guess I'll use it on Cliff, since he's right here. Well, okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> you healed by one! <laughs> you, get a, you, do get add, uh, you do get to add your modifier for that one. Yeah. So, oh, wait, it doesn't have that on. Okay, hold on, let me... Let me. I'm gonna roll again just to see what my modifier was. Oops, that was not the right one. Uh, three, three. Okay, so yep. four. So four. Okay. That's a little better than one. So you healed me. Put me at eight. All right. Uh, and then I'm going to. Move? They would get an attack of opportunity if I tried to move through them, wouldn't they? Yes. All right. Then, no, nah, I'm not gonna move. All right, Simon. All right. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna shoot him with my crossbow. There's not really, I can't really squeeze in there very well. Mm-hmm. Are you shooting? Which one are you oh, shooting? Uh, I guess the red one. That is a hit. 
One second, and sneak attack. 15 damage. Nice. All necessary. Right. Nice. <laughs> he is dead. Yes. Oh, boy. A little skull and crossbones on him. All right. Was that the one that rolled a one on the initiative? Um, no, that was, that's the green one. All right, Ulthrin. All right, I'm going to attack green because it's right there. All right. Um, you can move if you want to. You can move up. Uh, oh, no, you don't have to. Never mind. 14 is a hit. Nice. Big money, big money, big money. Nice. That's not bad. Oh, not bad. Not bad. I'm gonna move him out of the way so I can see. Wait, wait. Thing. What is that? Oh. Three uh, And by not bad, I mean that kills him. Nice. What's not the, bad. This is a uh, 1d8 plus 3 plus 3 again. No. It should be 1d8 oh. plus strength. So. Ignore that roll. You, okay. Wait, do you have Hold a on. dueling? Did you take dueling? Because that would add two. No. Why is it adding plus eight to your longsword? Don't know. Here, let me see if... Should we pl it's adding plus six. Yeah. Okay. There we go. I just fixed it. So we can take three out of that. Okay. Well, like, what uh, what fighting style did you take? Uh, just, I don't know. But like I fixed a... it. I had it on there twice for some reason, so now it's rolling correctly. Okay, all right, we're good. Because if you had a dueling, still alive. If you took dueling as a fighting style, it would add two. Can I try to rush him on my last? Uh, no, that would be a okay. full rush is not a movement action, right? It's an actual oh. action. Yeah, yeah. Or actually, it's an attack action, so if he had two attacks, he'd be able to do it. Okay, no, I don't. So, I will just stay here then. But you can, uh, you can move right. him now. Like, uh, there's one of them is dead. Yeah, that one's dead, so you can move over him. The red one is? Or yeah. The red the one one's is, still yeah. Alive. Oh, no, wait, the green one's still his life. Oh, and, yep. but the green one's still chained up, right? Yes, yep. The blue one's the only one not chained up. Okay, well, I'll move right. here. Try to... Okay. Give them some I, space. The green one is going to bite at you, um, and miss. Flynn, get that blue one, Tyler. Got to take him out. Yeah, I have to save Please Matt. Do. Please do. Because <laughs> I have no heels left. I've used up all my heels. Okay, I'm gonna come all the way back into the dungeon to get myself a clear shot. Okay, you're going to provoke an attack of opportunity against the green, or from the green one. I'm, I'm moving through cliff. Yeah, but you're still moving in an adjacent square to the enemy, which is an attack of opportunity. Okay. Um, okay. Yep, uh, and he misses. All right. Well, I want to get a clear shot of the blue one and roll my long bow. Short bow? Yeah, it's called the long bow. Oh, <laughs> oh Jesus. Nice. Oh, does that mean it ricochets back and hits the other one? <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn it. I keep doing the wrong thing. Sorry. I gotta learn how to use these buttons. You should still it be does able to nine just click damage. under it. Uh, yeah, no, I, I, no, I it does an extra, uh, an extra damage die because you crit the first one. Yeah, it, it's in there. It's 1d6 plus 3, which is the 5. And then plus 4 is the crit. Okay, alright. So 9 damage. Alright, cool. Um, hey, side right. note. Sorry, real quick. In the turn order, you've got that wolf, the 16, as the green, and you have the one as the green. Oh, one of the... The, the 16 is the... Uh, no. Red? Man. Yeah, 16 red. should have been the red. Okay. Yeah. yeah, so I'll just get rid of that one. There we go. Attack the darkness, Mike. Finish I'm it off. Attack the darkness. Miss hits Matt. Fireball. Um, <laughs> Blue one. Yeah. Okay. Can I see him from there, Casey? Uh, let's see here. Yeah, yeah, you can get him. Okay. Oh, shit. Nice. is a hit. 
It does have the spells. Alright, that one is Program. dead. Yay. Yay. Alright, foe hammer. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Run, full hammer. Run. <laughs> Stay there. <laughs> Hide under the dead wolf's body. Full hammer. What are you? What are you hammering? Are you hitting cliff? Blue? What are you the doing? Wall. Oh, Blue's dead. dead. Okay. Uh, then yeah, I'm going to go there. Okay. And then attack. No all flanking right. today Six. at all. Yeah, sixteen is a hit. It's a bold flanking maneuver. Yep. 17. Four, seven. Oh, seven. Sorry. All right, that one is dead. Nice. Yay! Go team. We killed three wolves, guys. Way to go! You didn't it get almost used ended us. <laughs> you only got Can Flynn skin them? Uh, you bet it'll take some time. Can we feast oh, yeah. on their bones to Wait, replenish well. our health? <laughs> Are any of them like alive, but just mostly dead? No. What about yeah, the one that was crit? Dead. Yeah, we could. Uh... <laughs> what about the one that we crit really hard? It's just a crippling blow. <laughs> like when you do a melee attack, you can like hold your bolt, your blow, and so like they just go unconscious. I yeah, you tell us. Yeah, we we didn't do that though. Yeah, what about the one I crit and then Mike put a fireball on it? Is that one still alive? <laughs> no, they're all nope. dead. <laughs> <laughs> Is that one roasted the to a nice on? savory singe? Oh, I lost another arrow. This is becoming a tedious to keep track of. Hey, we only need to kill 87 more for plus one valor, man. <laughs> <laughs>